Hello everyone, welcome back to EV's Queen. I hope you guys are doing great. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you're new here and be sure to leave a like, leave a comment and let us know what you want to see next. Neo's models are finally close to being able to use higher capacity semi-solid-state batteries according to the latest regulatory filings. China's Ministry of Industry and Information Technology on May 9 released a catalog of the latest batch of models that will soon be allowed to be sold in China, as well as hundreds of vehicle companies' filings for vehicle specification changes for public comment. The public can submit feedback between May 10 and May 16. Entry into the, these catalogs is a key regulatory process by which a model can be allowed to be sold or approved for specification changes in China. NIO did not file for new models but did file for three models with an expansion of the specification information to add semi-solid state batteries to the battery information. The three models include two SUVs and one sedan model numbers which are like gibberish you can see on the screen well the specification changes for all three models add the use of battery cells from Huzo, we lie and technology the assembly based on this cell is produced by a subsidiary of neo in nanjing the information does not mention solid state batteries but Huzo we lion is a wholly owned Subsidiary of new semi-solid state battery supplier Beijing Weilian New Energy Technology. New announced the 150 kilowatt hour semi-solid state battery when it unveiled its flagship sedan, the Neo ET7, at the Neo Day 2020 event on January 9, 2021. Although deliveries have not yet began, Weilian saw the first solid state battery cell roll off the assembly line at its battery production facility in Huzhou. Zhejiang Province, Eastern China. We Lion celebrated the occasions with a ceremony attended by Neo Senior Vice President Zheng Shuzhang and officials from Huzhou City, according to the company's press release at the time. Zheng is the CEO of XPT Neo's electric drive division and a director of We Lion. We Lion started construction of its battery base in Huzhou in 2021 and completed construction of the plant and production line after a year, said Tian Kiyo, general manager of the company Huzhou branch at the time. The latest specification change filing shows that the V-Line's batteries, Neo's vehicles will weigh just 20 kilograms more than before. Neo has not updated the information about the battery in recent months. Its co-founder and president Kim Li Hong said at a face-to-face -face event in Jiangsu province on February 11 that Neo owners will be able to start experiencing the 150 kilowatt hour pack during this summer. The pack will initially be available for rent only, with a buyout option available in the future, Kim said at the time. And that is it for today. Thank you for watching the video. Have a great day.